Hi, I'm Mr. Wu Mingyo. I'm going to discuss the relationship between displacement velocity and acceleration. Okay, for example, let's say that the displacement is 2 meter. What does this mean? This basically means that if I have an object that moves from position A to position B, the difference in length between the starting position and the final position it will be 2 meter. Okay, now let's move on to velocity. If I say that the velocity is 2 meter per second, this means that the displacement is increasing by 2 meter every second. Okay, and that actually brings us to the definition of velocity, which is what we call the rate of change of displacement. We can also say that velocity is how fast the displacement is changing. Okay, now let's move on to the last part which is acceleration. Okay, same thing. If I will say that acceleration is 2 meter per second squared, this means that the velocity is increasing by 2 meter per second every second. With this, we can explain why, why the unit of acceleration is meter per second squared. Because if you look at this, velocity increases by 2 meter per second per second. That is why the unit for acceleration is meter per second squared. Okay? And with this, it will bring us to the definition of acceleration, which is the rate of change of velocity. And we can also choose to represent this in a formula, which is acceleration is equal to the change in velocity over the time, which we usually write in symbol, it will be acceleration is equal to final velocity minus initial velocity, t minus u divided by t.